Hello all, this video demonstrates the GPS module built on Skylab SKG13BL. The board has got RS232 connection as well as TTL pinouts. This SKG GPS module works on 3.3 volt DC. As the regulator is on board, you can safely provide up to 12 volt DC input. A 9 volt battery is enough to power up this uh, GPS module. On the back side of the board you can see this 3.3 uh, volt regulator. One external patch antenna is provided with this module. This patch antenna is magnetic in type so you can uh, stick it onto any metal part. Make sure that this patch antenna faces the sky. This patch antenna enables you to work indoor with this GPS module. To connect the GPS to laptop, we make use of a TTL to USB converter built on CP2102 Silicon Labs IC. Only two wires needed to connect with GPS. One is the ground wire and the other one is the signal wire. Signal wire is from uh, TX of GPS to RX of USB module. After plugging the module to laptop, watch out for the signal LED on GPS module. This is the status LED. This blinks according to the inflow of signal. Once the GPS gets uh, fixed, the status LED blinks according to the flow of signal. To know the COM port allotted to the USB module, open the device manager and under uh, ports you can note down the COM port. Here the COM port allotted is COM1 that is the Silicon Lab CP2102 USB to UART board. Open up the terminal software like PuTTY and then select serial. Feed in the uh, board rate as 9600 and open the terminal to see the NMEA sentences flowing in. The GPRMC sentence is of interest to us. It has got all information like uh, longitude, latitude, time, speed, etc. Once the GPS has got a fix, you see uh, A in the GPRMC sentence. If you get V, then it means it is void and the GPS has got uh, no fix. Once the GPS gets uh, fix, you see A and then the latitude, longitude data. Instead of USB to TTL board, you can also use a, a USB to RS-232 converter. In this case, uh, a RS-232 cable, a straight cable is used for connection between uh, GPS module and the converter. Thank you for watching.